Welcome back to Game Does Play Games, where we play games while talking game design. Today we are playing Keyboard Sports by Triband, the humble monthly uh, humble original. original. Is it? It's just the humble it's original. Humble, it's, it's is a humble monthly original or humble original? Probably just well, a humble they, original. It's it's a humble original. They give it out in the monthly subscription. Ah. So, and I think that's the only way to get most future people. Chris. Put up the the humble um, original logo. Boom! Right now. Okay. All right. Cool. All right, so we're playing keyboard sports, um, and this game looks charming as hell. And we just realized that that's not just a hockey puck; that is a Roomba. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I'm so happy that you can push it around and not like ah, go through it or something. So you have played this, and I have not. I've beaten this game. It's, oh, okay. It's, it's pretty short, um, but I do know that the developers are making a full version. So the whole core concept is that you move this character around with your keyboard. Um, this, by the way, is incredible that the way you play the game is incorporated into the, you know, start menu. That's oh, it's awesome. fantastic. I, I love it. I, I'm always a fan of that, I mean, and they did it really well. That alone just kind of teaches you how to play the game, right? Like, ah, what do you do? do? I... How do you jump? What I do don't do? know how to jump. Can I jump? I don't know how to jump. You're not doing it. I'm not just jumping. So another thing we found out later uh, by accident uh, is that there's like no way to exit the game, to exit the game because it requires the keyboard. <laughs> yeah, oh my god, normally I'm the like worst at this game. What am I supposed to? No, don't run into that. Ah. Ooh. Ouch. Wouldn't it be funny if it was like game over and then that's it? <laughs> It'd be, oh, no. they're so clever. Chapter one, taking control. <laughs> oh my. All right, let's do this. Ah, it's like I was opening my eyes as the person, but I can see myself. Out you, of body experience. You hit your head when you failed. That sport, oh, you it's are confused now. a waste of time. Now. <laughs> you need to calibrate your keyboard. Close your eyes. Imagine your keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, just... creepy guy. Like when you close your eyes, he just steals your stuff when you're not watching. What is the shape of your enter key, young one? Pick one using the mouse. Of all things, the mouse. <sighs> yeah. I mean, to be fair, why? how would you be on a computer without a mouse? You could, but how does your keyboard look? Pick one of the following with your mouse. Sounds like this would be harder, but oh, well, this is actually how our keyboard it's, looks. So. Well, it, it's if you notice, the key layouts are different, so that's why it's important. Yeah. Because this, this is a little bit different than... Uh, yeah, maybe. and I mean, they, anyway, they could even be right. like one of those crazy European keyboards for all I know. Good. Take a second look to be sure. This is important. See? See? If you want to recalibrate your keyboard later, press and hold the mouse button. Come and see me at my home when you wake up. Oh, that's how you exit. You, I think you just like click the screen and then it pulls up. The, I uh, tried just clicking the screen because I was like, huh, maybe the irony is that the mouse exits and I click the screen, nothing happens. I guess you uh, have to hold the It might be button. at a certain point in the game. You look better. I am Master QWERTY. <laughs> you are no good at sports. I will train you, young one. Now, come closer. Enter my house. Boop. <laughs> <laughs> the puns are great. Please, sit down in the cozy space. <laughs> it's the best. Ah, good. I like you, young one. Now, I teach you real sports. Keyboard sports. First, you must find your inner key. First, step to the... the oh, I guess I did like a little tea. early. Now, bring it to me. You, you picked up... I was me. literally just hitting a button, and that turned out to be what he wanted. Boom. <laughs> no. Boom. No. So uh, he asks you to get, bring him tea, and it, you hit the letter, the, the key, key, to tea. To pick up Ah, oh, thank you, Slurp. To make room for the future, one must clean my trophy room. Clean the trophy room, and come back to me. Left shift to my trophy room. <laughs> the trophy room. There's so many trophies. <laughs> the, All right, so. So if I, yeah. So this is all things considered a like proper tutorial level like learn how to just do things <laughs> boom boom get all the stuff out of here we don't want this stuff get out get out yeah, boom. yeah. Oh. i like that you can kick it into the gongs too yeah yeah i think you're good good yeah sometimes they kind of land outside of your your range looks clean to me now 
have a cup of tea. Oh no, how horrible. There is no more tea. <laughs> Exit to Keymart. Where they have what we need. Go now. Where is Keymart? Uh, I think it's, yeah. <laughs> you oh. can't enter my home again. Hit escape to go outside. So hit escape. It's, 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 Let's just escape. Oh, that is. Oh. Oh, there it is. I was like, but the Fooled escape you. doesn't have a <laughs> keyboard location. Boing. Boing. So they've integrated all the words into the keys, and those keys have a location to where you get to. Mm -hmm. So if you want to leave the house, you have to press the escape button. I mean, it makes sense, right? Also, press your favorite key to continue. Oh, I just hit something. Well, Hopefully. that's now your favorite key. <laughs> that's not important. <laughs> all right, so we're just going to go across the street and not get hit by a car. If you can dodge a car, you can dodge a ball. <laughs> God damn. Yeah. I just wanna, just wanna go. Yeah. You got this. Yeah. yeah. All right. Oh no! How horrible! The market is closed. Opens soon. So I'm gonna dodge cars until that happens. <laughs> yeah. Yup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's definitely what I did, but I mean, really, you could just hit a key in between and sit there. Um. But that kind of goes to, to show, like, how smart this game is. Because it's it's challenging to know where your keys are going to land you. Oh, yeah. Because you're not used to thinking of your key presses as, like, being associated to a space. It's. I think the other important thing to it, too, is that you're hitting keys that you don't normally hit. That's true, too. Yeah, I mean, you're hitting a lot of, like, symbols and stuff, too. Um, and so when I played this game on my own, I, I was really, like, uncomfortable about it. Market shift is now open. Yeah, so I was like, oh no, what if I hit, like, the escape key? Is it going to break the game? <laughs> wow. Yeah. Wreck the store. Well, no, it's just, I hate this stuff is all. <laughs> <laughs> Not the watermelons, anything but the melons. Get out of here. I want this tea. This is my, this is, this is my tea. Notice how it's also at the tea. It was, I, I did, I was like, why can't it pay? <laughs> oh, let me guess. All right. So, like, that backspace button. I was like, oh, I shouldn't hit that. So here's a question for you. Do you think that the key letters should be displayed on the the ground? I think they should not. I think that is what adds the charm and difficulty to the... Can I not get to... Okay, so I guess go, escape go is door. not the answer. Yeah, ah, you've got to go back ah, out the door. Ah, ah. <laughs> 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 da, da. <laughs> Left that shop in ruins. Good job, young one. Now yeah. come back here. Oh no, how horrible. The gate is caps lock. Uh, jerk. That's another one. You're basically trained your whole life to like not hit the caps lock button by accident. And all yeah, of a sudden it's right? like, hit the caps lock button. You're <laughs> like, but no, but everything will be ruined. Young one, drink tea. Next we fly to temple. Well, all right. I'm just going to drink straight out of the pot here. Ah. Uh, what was in that tea? <laughs> wow. Now things start getting crazy. Chapter 3, a shift in power. Press your least favorite key. Caps lock. <laughs> I might have done the same, actually. <laughs> oh no, how horrible. The plane is not good. <laughs> the plane is too heavy. Throw everything overboard. We were trained for this moment. Uh, oh my. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> oh, I control the. Oh. So I love how, like, everything seems, like, you know, pretty docile and, and like, non consequential at first. Um, you might be able to hit those mountains, by the way. Is that a good thing, or should I? <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and then all of a sudden, we are on a plane that's crash landing. This reminds me so much of Overcooked, it's not even funny. Yes! No! The, just that feeling. Go to the right ski and then bring me. Oh, bring it to my space. The, to you the have to right get this ski? I think it's. There's a ski oh, over here. oh, you, you have it already. Oh, well then. There you go. Get a ski for yourself and escape the plane. Audi. <laughs> it seriously does though like it's very it's it's the same kind of like 
absolute adorable quality and at the same time ridiculous and, and, and chaotic. And yeah, exactly. Like over the top chaotic that only gives you a wonderful sense of humor. This is amazing. Right? I am skiing. I am. St oh my. Yep. Now you gotta dodge plane parts. And there is no more key on the map anymore. Well, there is. You, you can't see it. Oh, maybe it is just totally not present. It'll ah, show you. Yeah, it'll oh, show you it hit me. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. Isn't oh my god, fantastic? I haven't had this much fun since Overwatch, actually. That, or not Overwatch, uh, uh, Overcooked. Overcooked, yeah, no, that's exactly how I felt, too. I was they're, like, they're tapping into the fun. You you start playing the game, and you're like, yeah, yeah, alright, I, I kind of get this gimmick, and these puns are, like, keeping me going. And then you hit the plane scene, and you're just like, everything is different, everything is crazy. Stay down to duck. See you at the temple. So, if you, the key that you're currently on, so if you hit, like, H right now, and you hold it, you'll duck down. Uh, okay. Alright. So... So this part is, is actually a little challenging. This is where uh, I... I mean, this is actually where I started to fail when I was playing this, too. Right, makes sense, makes sense. I got this. Oh, is it randomly generated? Uh... This does not look the same as... No, I don't think it's randomly generated. I don't think you started in the same space, in the same place, though. Um... So we were talking uh, in between episodes, mm, mm. Um, and we kind of mentioned this in the last episode, if you guys saw the Stifled uh, video. <sighs> um, but we, we watched a, what, what was the channel? Game Game Maker's Toolkit? Yeah. Um, they had a video talking about how like Nintendo's uh, strength in design is that they choose like one mechanic and they kind of make the, the like a very fun single mechanic and they build a game that kind of revolves around that entire concept um keyboard sports i think is another game that really like lives that philosophy absolutely that's i, I mean that's what's been going through my head they use uh this concept of moving with something that you take for granted i guess we take our keyboard for granted and we never have thought of using it as a a a map, like a, a actual movement map, like you, you know what I'm saying. And, and oh, I did especially not when that. you see this game, you're like, it's so obvious. Like, how has no one done this before? How hasn't anyone done? Oh, okay. I mean, maybe someone has, right? Um, but I think that the the guys making keyboard sports are going to make that. It's it's like I'm when worse um, this game. typing games started becoming a thing, right? Like you know, typing of the dead, where you type in the, the letters to, like, kill the zombies before they reach you, right? So there was a huge... I don't remember what the first game was that did it, but after that first one was made, like, there was a huge surge of those games, and now it's an established genre. I feel like this is def defining. Like, this is kind of its own new genre in itself. This, this absolutely actually could awaken, like, a new potential type of game out there. Uh, especially um, if I can get past this stage. <laughs> oh, you definitely can. You'll get used to it. Um, especially because it's like, there's no no concern about whether or not the players have a keyboard, because who doesn't have a keyboard if you're playing on a computer? You have to duck yeah. there. Oh, maybe not. Ah! So it's like, it's already accessible, because everyone already has a keyboard. So it's just a new control with something that everyone already has. Why is everything lava? Oh, no. oh yeah, this is this is where things get crazy. Okay. I know I said that already, but this is I think this is the hardest part of the game. It's exactly what you think it is. Okay. Oh, I understand. <laughs> oh crap. Yep. Yep. <laughs> all right. So this is all right. So let's. Oh no. All right. Lesson learned, this time. So the yeah, there we go. Bam! No, oh, no, 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 no! Ah, no! Just go for it. Go, go, for go, it. go! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so we're gonna go. We're gonna get. Okay. Oh, 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 oh balls! All right, all right. We got this. So this is. It's like uh, basically like your home row has changed. Right. Kind of, yeah. All right, all right. Yeah, this is like, all a lot of the other challenges so far have just been like, 
making sure you respond in the right direction. That challenge right there was teaching mm. the player um, precision. Press Chapter the four, biggest key. Mind your space. I think uh, one thing that, that I find interesting so far is it's actually... You've noticed how I've been moving left and right. That's because you're so used to hitting the keys on the left and right side of the keyboard, you forget about hitting the center. First go to the chaos space. First you go to the chaos space. <laughs> then you go to the calm space. Before that he said you're almost ready for your tea. Hold on to your mind space until you're all the way in. Keep spacing out. <laughs> Do not let go yet. <laughs> right. The key puns are... Uh, great. Like, I was won over the, the moment they made their first key pun. Ooh. Okay. Also, do you know this reference? This is totally a... Um, Inception? No, this is a... Um, oh, no. Am I going to forget the name of this show? Uh, uh, the episode one where everyone's crying. Huh? The TV show, old TV show from, like, the late 80s. Mm. Oh, uh, 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 I hated that show. Uh, <laughs> only because of that first episode. Um, um. Oh. Twin Peaks. Twin Peaks. Thank oh you. my wow. god. Alright, so follow the spotlight. Names. Gotta follow that spotlight, I guess. Got yeah, just gonna follow this spotlight. I'll turn up the volume a little bit so you can hear. But it goes like nice, like, classical violin music. And the moment you're outside of it, it's like crazy drum solo, like bluesy drum solo, or jazzy maybe. <laughs> it's kind of fun. <laughs> it's a nice, like, stark contrast, too, with music to tell you whether or not you're doing things right or wrong. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. This is actually a good ah. moment of teaching no. intuitive design, too. Oh my god, this is really difficult, and... It's, it's a lot harder than you'd think it would be. I think the light is also shrinking, too. I think you're good. Pirouette! Oh, I thought I was doing that. I was like, oh, look at me going back and forth between these two spaces. I'm spinning. I'm so clever. No, don't go further in, man. Don't go in. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I'm out. Okay, good. Or am I? <clears throat> well done, young one. You have found your inner key. <clears throat> key? <laughs> I will show you keyboard sports. Now, drink the special tea. Beware, after special tea is the final trial. Now, you are ready. No more training. <laughs> I don't believe you. <laughs> I still don't know how to jump. <laughs> <laughs> Chapter 5, There is no escape. Press two keys. What do I have Welcome. a crossbow? <laughs> Welcome to the real keyboard sports. To shoot, hold any one key and tap the second key. Try it! Oh my. Oh my. Oh yes. Oh yes. Is this made with Unity? I don't know. It feels like it was made with Unity. It's, it's a little hard to tell. I mean, it, I think it very easily could have been. Good, now hit the target three times and the games will begin. Uh, just wanna... Nope, nope. Mm, just gonna keep. Yeah, there we go. Ready for keyboard sports? Shoot everything! Don't get hit! Ah, ah, ah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. It's the perfect amalgamation of everything you've learned. Ugh. With something new. So, I, I think this game does a great job at kind of introducing some little new challenge every single time you enter a new zone, or new chapter, I guess. Um, and even in the final moments, after your training uh, is complete, they still teach you something new, which I think is pretty fantastic. Wow. I give yeah. you 105. Remain calm. To move on. Shoot the, the gong to retry. So if you don't do anything, the game ends. Because you got a score of 105, which is weak. So I vote you at least get one good run in and, and kind of show what the final keyboard sports are, are like. We can even make it a competition if you want, because I'm just going to say, I did not so bad myself. I hate you. <laughs> Remember in a pro Oh my god, what? You, you, you can shoot those cars. 
<laughs> yeah, they keep throwing new things, and it's randomly generated. So, hey, you got a score of 208 that time. So every time it throws different things at you, it always starts with the little demon dudes. Um, but it'll it'll come in different. The waves will will all be different. Oh, oh, oh. I tried to. So what's difficult about it is whatever key you're pressing first is the direction that you go, and then everything you shoot after that, or everything you press after that, is where you shoot. So mm -hmm. if you let go of a key, and then press it again, instead of moving in that direction, you might start shooting in that direction, and now you're running in a different direction. That makes any sense. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. So the way I usually try to do it is try to find a safe space. So I tend to stay toward the bottom. Although using staying on the space bar tends to be kind of a danger zone since it's such a wide area, um, but try not to move too much. Try to actually stay station stationary as long as you can, and just kill like everything. Asteroids. Yeah, yeah. And the moment that you, you're being overwhelmed by numbers, just move to one new spot because they'll move in a straight line until they stop. They won't chase you. And fortunately, you don't actually have to worry about how many crossbow bolts you're using. Ooh. Whoa. There you go. You got this. Big guys. So what are your thoughts on, on keyboard sports in Ooh. general? So far, now that it's taught me everything I need to know, it's been pretty amazing actually by the way i find that the the best way to do it is like find your two safe spots so first my like immediate one is like the the space bar after that oh man uh can i give it a try yeah man go for it show me up after you like and then if the moment that your major safe spot is compromised go to your second one and then you can move back oh uh, man it's been a little while so <clears throat> i might actually do worse than you hopefully not hopefully not I want to These show... people need to see some real keyboard sports. No, right? There we go. Yeah, what? 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 Yeah. Ain't no stopping this. <laughs> oh, Closen. Yeah, oh, da, 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 da. Okay, do it? here we go. So this is infinite. It'll it'll go until you die. Okay, so now we're like actually doing the real keyboard sports. Yeah, this is the real keyboard sports. So and that's why he gives you a score at the end every time. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, uh, that's. So I'm wondering, is this just because you said this? Uh, there's they're planning on like making this a full game, right? Mm -hmm. So then, there's a. Uh, this is just like kind of like the procedural. Uh, oh, this is the one challenge, I, the I guess. So yeah. if this is just a procedural challenge, I wonder if they're going to come up with more story and stuff. I, I think that's probably the idea. I mean, I, they would be able to answer that better than me, obviously. Yeah, but. you guys are watching. You should answer that. I would like to know <laughs> if you're going to if you're planning on coming up with more story because doing the like skydiving that that was awesome. That's oh, absolutely. Yeah, this the actual main story as I think where this game excels. I do think that this procedural thing is a lot of fun. Oh, I don't want to be there. Oh. Oh. oh my goodness. Doing it, guys. I'm doing it. Woo. Um, And I, I think they probably added the procedural... Oh, geez, I was not expecting that. I think the procedural part is just to kind of give the game longevity, right? Because um, if it just ended right here, then, you know, then it'd be kind of like, okay, well, that was fun, but I wish I could, like, do more. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so this is kind of the means of doing more, and now it's a score-based game, so you can play against your friends can and you compare like your scores. you pick up the trophies or anything? Nah, you just bonk them. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, 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 pro. These cars don't scare me. What? 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 <laughs> oh, man. For some reason, this also reminds me a little bit of Incredible Crisis. That's another game that we need to put back on the show. Ooh, yeah, we actually we tried, tried to recording record that once. Yeah. That was back in the way early days of GDPG, though. God, this might be so my... ugly. Oh, Ooh. oh, yeah, 
Yeah. Doing it. No, 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 uh, no, no, no. Why don't you just uh, move? <laughs> I thought I had him. Uh. <laughs> ah. Score of 908. Amateur. 908. I think that was actually the best run I've had yet. <laughs> So cool. we'll, we'll let this this close out so you guys can see the the full end of the game. But I think it's just credits. Yeah. End. God. So it's keyboard sports. Super fun. Oh. Absolutely check out this game. I don't know if they <clears throat> they have a website which a lot of the humble originals don't, which is kind of disappointing. So check out their website and you can follow them on Twitter and and whatnot. I don't know when they plan on releasing the full game, but but we'll be waiting cuz this was awesome. Right? God, yeah. This is this is definitely why I I'm growing more and more fond of the humble originals because every time it's like this really unique game that yeah. They feels... even say straight up they're like these may or may not be good games but they're risky and we're giving them a chance. I mean yeah. this one was that's maybe that's why the logo reminds me of Adult Swim actually because Adult Swim is all about giving people a chance that normally wouldn't have one and that's a lot what the humble original is about. That's pretty fair. So, uh, I guess any any other final thoughts about keyboard sports? I feel like we we talked about most of the the design things going on here. Um, I mean, I think I've said most of it, but uh, it, challenge of the day is very simple. Obviously, mm. make a game for keyboard sports, or make a, a level sport. Or chapter. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Make a sport. Um, so I got really distracted by that <laughs> the skiing stage. Uh, if yeah. you guys want us to come back and play the full version of Keyboard Sports, which we might just do anyway because we had a blast with it, but go ahead and vote for it in this thing above. And uh, if there's any other thing you want us to play in the meantime, you've got two other choices. So yeah, let us know. Bye. Bye, everyone. <laughs>